So this is a really good practice for connecting to the ground, grounding yourself, keeping it all calm, keeping yourself strong and centered. So take a big wide stance, strong in the legs, tuck your tail underneath you. So the upper body is kind of straight, just stacked up. Your arms are loose as if you're holding something soft against your belly, space in each armpit for an egg. You should by now be feeling this on the tops of your legs. So we're really building capacity here. Loose in the upper body, strong, strong, strong in the lower body. Really good, well done. So step into a wide stance now, straight into a wide shoulder width stance. Hands on your belly or dantian. We're just going to practice taking your weight over one leg and then the other leg. Keeping your body, your torso stacked up so it's just the dantian that's gliding one way and the other way. And if that's comfortable, you can lift diagonally opposite hand and foot when you're over the leg. If that's too wobbly, you can leave your toe on the ground for balance. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. We're going to go back into deep standing, building capacity here. So again, a big wide stance, tail tucked underneath you and being still in this posture, feeling your legs working. Pip is also being still in this posture. Keep breathing, feeling it in your legs. Keep your shoulders really loose. Don't get them up by your ears, nice and soft, rounded, easy arms. Really good. So you've built loads of capacity there. Let's come back up. Having your feet underneath your hips now, soft knees. We're just going to stand still and allow the body to settle. It's also going to stand. Again, soft shoulders. Balancing in your belly. And then relax your hands down. You should feel quite grounded. <laughs>